I'm Carol Johnson. I'm the Executive Director of the Amherst Cinema Arts Center, and we operate the Amherst Cinema, and we have until today operated the, non, the Pleasant Street Theater as a part of our nonprofit umbrella. I've been director since it opened in 2006, since Amherst Cinema opened in 2006. Um, the Pleasant Street Theater was operated by someone else until the end of 2007, and then in early 2008, uh, we brought that under the umbrella of our nonprofit and began operating it as a part of our organization. Pleasant Street Theater has been there for many, many years. It was the original art house theater in this area beginning in the mid-70s. Um, when we looked at what we needed to do for the future, what we were looking at was the fact that we're going to have to invest really substantial sums of money in new projection technology. The Pleasant Street Theater, we do not own that, we rent it, and uh, I don't know if you've been there, but it is um, not handicapped accessible. One of the theaters is downstairs and the restrooms are downstairs, and there just really isn't any way to fix the, the physical limitations there. So combined with the fact that it has physical limitations that just can't be fixed and looking ahead at what we're going to have to invest for new projection technology, we just determined that the best use of our resources is to focus on Amherst Cinema. That building is owned by uh, a gentleman who runs uh, Downtown Sounds, Joe Blumenthal, who's been a very good landlord for us. Um, he acquired that building about five years ago, uh, in 2007, I believe. And it, it's really up to him what happens to the, the space. We just encourage people to come to Amherst Cinema uh, because this is where independent film is going to be happening in the valley from here forward. We're going to be showing about 125 films a year that you wouldn't see at the commercial cineplexes. Uh, we also have plays captured live in HD from Britain's National Theatre. We have a fall uh, film series on Japanese film. We're going to be doing a series with the Hitchcock Center celebrating their 50th anniversary. And we have a whole number of other events where we'll be welcoming uh, filmmakers from all over the world who will be coming here. So there's a lot going on in Amherst, and we really um, appreciate all the support the community has given us to bring us this far.